Thank you for choosing Pretty Jaguar and Land Rover. Today I'll be teaching you how to change your climate settings using the Touch Pro operating system. So first thing you want to do is open the climate menu located here on your bottom screen. Once you've reached the climate menu, you have a plethora of options to choose from. Each one of these bars here signifies an independent vent that works on the car. So the top gray bar is going to be your top defrost vents for your windshield. Your middle bar, which is now turned on, is going to be the normal vents that hit you in your face and chest area. And then the bottom bar are going to be your feet vents for below the steering wheel. So from here, I can actually turn on where the air comes from by selecting and deselecting vents. So if I select all these vents over here, now every single vent in the car is producing air. But I don't want that. I just want the normal vents to hit me. From here we have the option of pressing auto which lets the car automatically adjust your airflow most people don't use that though you also have the option of pressing sync now what sync does makes it so that you no longer have independent temperature controls so in the default setting i can set the driver's side to 74 but leave the passenger side on 59 if i were to press sync however all temperatures are now controlled by this left knob and the fan speed is controlled by this right knob if I turn sync off and I want to adjust the fan speed, I can simply touch the fan button here, use the right knob to lower it, and then I'm done. These buttons over here help change different factors of your AC and climate. The AC button allows the AC to turn on and actually cool the air. This button specifically here may not be in all vehicles, but this turns on your heated windshield. If you do not have a heated windshield, right here you'll have a symbol that looks similar to this to turn on your uh, front windshield defroster. This will be your rear windshield defroster, and this button will be for air recirculation. This button right here simply signifies that this is to control your media and volume. Here you have two different buttons located on the bottom black screen. Now these buttons aren't normal buttons, but actually pressure controlled buttons. So you need to touch and hold them firmly to actually activate them or deactivate them. This button will turn your max AC on, which will call, turn all your fans all the way up and turn your temperature to the lowest possible setting. And this band button will do your max air defrost. So it will turn the heater up, vents up, and fan speed all the way up to defrost that windshield for you. Now we also have the option of changing your seats. So if we go to the seat icon, now we can control our seats. You can also adjust which seats and which climate you want to control by pressing the front or rear button up here. Now to control your seats, you can simply turn them on. And then now we have heated seats and left is going to be cold seats. Each different setting has three different levels. Let's say you're on the climate menu, however, and you wanna adjust your seats quickly. All you have to do is simply press down this ring and now you're controlling your seats. And once again, left is cooling and right is heating.